Hey everybody, to say the least, oh shoot, is that gray in my beard or is that cheese? Hey everybody, to say the least, we have had some wet weather. We've got mud all around the house. If you can see the mountains in the background here, they're covered in snow. We've been around the house doing some stuff here. Lorenzo and I mounted a flatbed on the newest Anchor Brand Ranch, famous ranch truck. Check that thing out. The door on the other side is red. All right, let's go see what Riley and Rance are up to. So it's almost time to ship some calves off to market. Time to pay bills. Had to go and borrow a cattle truck from my dad. You've seen me do that before. And it's time to really get out on the actual highway. We always go borrow a decent truck. But his truck, which is nicer than anything we own or anything I've ever driven, didn't pass its DOT inspection. It had one tire, a little short on tread, and the little pump that sprays the water on your windshield wasn't working. You can't pass without that. You got it? So this is the old one, and we're too late to see the mechanics. It's all put in and functioning? It's functioning. Well, anyways, now it's one step closer to passing the DOT inspection, Riley and Rants. Got the little pump put on it. What was the hardest part of doing this job? Figuring out how to get the bumper down. <laughs> he came to the house, he's like, how do you lower that big old bumper down? Also needed a new rope on the gate. Riley got a new rope on it, but he said he had two short pieces instead of one long piece, so he's got a Square, square knot there in the middle of his gate rope. Mud and water everywhere, huh? Well, that'll work for now, yeah. Riley drained all the water out of the trailer, also in the yard. Hey, everybody, you never know what's going to happen. Last night I got a call from my friend Robert. He's got a truck for me to pick up down here in Las Vegas. Next thing you know, I'm getting strip searched. Got my pocket knife, took it away from me. And I'm at the flea market with Lorenzo. <laughs> like I said, there's a lot of uh, different things. I'm trying out some chocolatinas. How do you say that, Lorenzo? Crickets. Basically, I'm eating bugs. Yep. That's good. How come you're not eating any? I'm good. <laughs> Are you going to eat any? No, I'm good. There's a first time for everything and a last time for everything. I think that's my last time to eat that type of bugs, but thank you. Yeah, Chapulines. Never even heard of it, but it's some bugs. A little bit spicy. Lorenzo likes it. He's going to take some so he can eat them on the trail back at the ranch. Yeah, so anyways, we're just kind of killing time here, doing some looking around, a little bit of shopping. Wait for Mr. Robert to get this truck ready that we're going to take back to the ranch. It was unexpected, but you never know when Mr. Robert comes up with a good deal. You got to come to town and see what he's got going on. Maybe soon I won't have to bum a truck off my dad every time I need to haul cows. What's that? Uh, what are these called? Churros. Well, we ate those at your house one day, huh? Yeah. Okay, all right. I'm getting cultured. I'll get it all figured out. So I got this figured out. It's like coming to Mexico without coming to Mexico. Another by the person, I said no. No, because that's just how Robert is. He's got more sh every, all over the place in everybody's yard and whatever. Surprised he ain't got stuff in this guy's yard. I, he probably does, I don't know. I asked him one day. And I said, Robert, how many, uh, how many people's property do you occupy? <laughs> he goes, occupy? And that's the answer I got. Just throw that center down on the seat, why don't I? Shit, on the floor. Hold on for it, I'm gonna light the truck on fire. I don't know, I don't 
Smoke will tell you where it's yeah, at in a minute. Until my ass starts heating up, there's <laughs> smoke coming out of it. See, I done forgot all about it. Did you smell that marijuana that was sitting there when you got in the truck? Mm -hmm. You did, huh? Yeah. I know, because all of a sudden I looked at it and went, oh, I forgot I even put that there. And I didn't even smoke none of it. I didn't either. I stayed out of it the whole time. Yeah, I just had to say, oh. And I started messing around with it. I was like, shit stinks. <laughs> Some somebody said they had a whole bunch of them, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, okay, whatever, dude. <laughs> and I just set it down. Forgot all about it. I know that guy had to smell that. Hardly ever smoked that stuff. So because what happens is, is I'm wondering what the fuck I've done. What happened? Why am I so messed up? So as you can see, it was an interesting day down in Las Vegas. Went into some uh, interesting, kind of a little bit shady locations. Did a little bit of wheelie dealing and trading around and grabbed a new truck for the ranch. It's gonna be a heck of a good deal. Headed home, gonna gather up some kids on the way, get everybody back to the house by tonight. So we made it to the dirt road, did a little switch on the fly. Riley's gonna check this thing out, see if he can drive it. It shifts pretty smooth, don't it? We've driven Cats and Cummins. First Detroit right here so far. What a fan. Got a lot of sleepy little kids here. Just about to make it back to the house and see if we can get them all unloaded. Everybody. Wait. Who is what? Uh, I spent the day in Vegas doing some junk trading with my friend Mr. Robert. Came home with a 2006 Western Star uh, Detroit 60 Series 13 speed Eaton Fuller. And I got a few other things in the trade that are on the way, like a 4BT Cummins to put in some kind of a ranch build. So lots of fun stuff. Yeah, that's needs a little cleanup and patch up on a few things, but it ran and drove strong, smooth, shifted smooth. It's a brand ranch. A new old truck. You got everybody? Yep. Double bunk sleeper. Got some paperwork. All right, we're gonna call it a day. Everything's off. Except for those two. All right. What do you think? It's pretty nice. <laughs> By our standards, it's a Cadillac. <laughs> <laughs>